So the goal of the study was to see if um, um, infant below 12 months of age uh, did possess a proper semantic representation of words. Um, a measure to assess this in the human EG is the, the event brain related potential called M400 which uh, uh, in adult has been clearly related to uh, semantic processing. And so it's enhanced for semantic violation and is uh, reduced for, uh, uh, for semantic integration. And the way to assess it is using uh, uh, a prime and a probe. A prime could be a sentence or a lexical context or even a picture, which is useful in the case of infants. And the probe is, is usually a word. Um, Below 12 months, this uh, uh, investigation has been o o always uh, a failure. So nobody has found it below below 12 or more reliably below uh, more reliable until 19 months. And we uh, want to change many things in the paradigm, and we establish a more live situation where the motor was uh, uh, priming the, the the world, and as probe we use uh, we use uh, a picture, and so practically the motor was in live getting a uh, a word uh, through headphones that the child might know, and then the 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 child see um, look at a screen, and uh, on this screen uh, a picture appear that could be uh, con congruous or incongruous with the word, so it's a modified. Uh, paradigm that is especially designed for infants and uh, it maximizes the likelihood that uh, the infant might understand that the word just there it refers to the the picture is going to see on the screen and when the when is the motor that uh, um, engage the infant in this live situation uh, we got a proper m400 effect so the the m400 is enhanced when the pair word picture was uh, incongruent, which is what we want to find, actually. It's quite impressive that it's very, very similar to what we get with the same paradigm in adults.